Hi there, and today we're going to be taking a look at Mr. Potato Head, Iron Man and Tony Stark. So let's take a look at what we've got here. So you've got him assembled in his costume in there, and a few extra little components there. We'll take a closer look at that in a second. Let's just examine the packaging. See everything we've got listed on the side and on the back. As you can see, you've got a little ad for um, the Spider-Man one also available, which hopefully we'll get to take a look at. But yeah, I think that's all there is to see on the packaging. So let's get them open. Right. Okay, so we've got some instructions. Nothing interesting at all. Taking a look at the figure as it's assembled in there, it's very nice. You can see he's got his repulsors in his hands, which are different than the um, kind of standard Mr. Potato arms. It's very nice. Same on the other hand. Um, with it being a Mr. Potato head, they're, they're going to really struggle to get the arc reactor in there, so it looks like they've got it tucked in the belt with a, a couple of other little ones instead of in his chest. And let's take a look at the um, all important face mask. Clips on right at the top. Very nice. I was half expecting it to uh, open like that, but there you go. You can see they've actually left a, a hole in the top there, so you can pop some other Mr. Potato Head accessories. And in the side of the helmet, if you want to have ears poking out there for some reason, it's Mr. Potato Head, so anything goes. There's nothing else really there. There's only one set of eyes in the packet, so I'll leave those there. Take a look at um, Mr. Stark's do. Oh, I am a fan of this little goatee. That's excellent. Looks really cool. Let's pop him on. Cheesy grin. Up to one side. Okay, and to be honest, the nose and the ears are just standard Mr. Potato Head fare. Nothing really to see. Oh, get in there. Same on the other side. Get his nose on. And yeah, it's pretty good. It looks as, as much like Tony Stark as I, I think you could get a Mr. Potato Head to look. Obviously, the whole point of Mr. Potato Head is use him with other components, so if you've got some other accessories lying around, Spider-Man one, could do a bit of a mashup. And uh, one thing that has just occurred to me is maybe we can get the helmet on the hole on the, uh, the back of his head. So let's give that a go. Ah, it's a real shame. Really got my uh, heart set on a tilted back uh, Iron Man mask, but ho-hum. But yeah, it's a very decent little toy. Good for a Marvel fan for your collection. Needs some eyes, doesn't he? Or just a good toy for youngsters in his own right. Oh no, I haven't got any repulsors in the bottom, but probably asking a little bit much there. But yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Be sure to check out the other Mr. Potato Head videos we've got. And if you are looking to buy one of these, Nice little toys, I'll leave you some links, item numbers, etc. in the description below. But yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Take care, bye bye.